it is time to get started on this soft purple blossoms color look. I'm super excited to be sharing with you how I apply these four colors. There is Blossom, Cashmere Haze, Soft Heather, and Merlot, which is a beautiful kind of wine color. It's really pretty, a nice plum. And uh, I'm excited to show you this. So uh, I'm going to also show you at the end how this makeup look um, looks with uh, different variations of these colors and then on different skin tones and hair color and all that good stuff. So um, it will be fun to see that. But first and foremost, make sure to tag your consultant if you're watching this and you have a Mary Kay Beauty consultant, make sure to tag her in the comments. Um, that way she knows that uh, that you had a chance to watch this and um, she can also maybe provide some free samples too to you as well. And with that being said, if you don't have a Mary Kay Beauty consultant, I'm going to just show you. These are some uh, of the samples of the eye colors that I'm going to show you today. And if you would like to have these samples sent to you and you don't already have a Mary Kay Beauty consultant, then uh, go ahead and request. I'll put in the description a link to request a, a set of these samples and then you can enjoy these on your own and kind of replay the video to follow along so it'll come in a cute little envelope like this you won't be able to miss it in your mailbox but i'm happy to do that so let's go ahead and jump in and get started here so remember to say hello where you're tuning in from tag your consultant and now we are going to go into the soft purple blossoms color look so the first one is the highlighter here this is called blossom and i'm going to actually put that just all over my lid. These colors that I'm trying are what you call chroma fusion life proof shadows. Life proof meaning they stay on once you put them on and they have good sticking power. And then also the chroma fusion is the fact that these colors stay true. So what you see in the compact is what you get. Okay. So they are very true to color. It just means they're highly pigmented is what it's called. So anyhow, the next color that um, I'm going to show you here is soft heather. So it's this one here. And I'm actually just going to go ahead and show you how I would normally apply this. I'm just going to put it right in the crease and kind of just go back and forth like that to get some of this color right there in the crease. So there's so many different combinations you could do with this particular color look. Um, I just love these plums. So they're really nice to uh, complement green eyes. Any Anyone can wear these colors, but especially green eyes, it seems to make that color really pop. So Okay, so that was soft heather that I just did in the crease. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and grab another brush and I'm going to use the cashmere haze and I'm just going to do a tiny bit kind of in the kind of outer part here. Not much, but just enough to kind of give it a little bit of shading here. So just kind of right on the lid. So you kind of see this is more cashmere and then it goes into the soft heather. And I'll probably go back over just to uh, make sure I have as much of the color on as possible. But I'm going to try to keep this area here a little bit light so that I think that it helps to kind of keep the color of your eyes pop when you keep the center a little bit more on the lighter side. It helps that. So I'm kind of just doing it on the lid just in that outer part there so just a little bit so see how it just kind of you want the colors to sort of flow from and blend from one color to the next and so that is the cashmere haze that i just applied on the outer part here and then in the crease is the soft heather so um what I'm going to do now is grab another brush. This one I'm actually going to use a smudger brush, it's called. It has a very fine um, kind of bristled tip. And this one I like to use because I'm going to apply now the Merlot. And the Merlot is a pretty intense color. It is absolutely beautiful. But I'm going to use this more like an accent color. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in the outer kind of edges of this corner here like that and then taking it in just a little bit so I still keep all of the color I've just applied between um, 
the soft heather and the cashmere haze, but this is just going to be accented on the outer corner. So I'm going to go ahead and apply it to the other side and then I'm going to blend it all in. So it's just a little bit in the outer corner there. Okay. All right. So now I'm going to take my handy dandy blender brush and I'm going to blend all this color a little here. So we're going to soften up this edge here and then soften over here. See how it kind of just softens the look a little bit, but you're still seeing the color definition between all three. So yeah, just a little bit to soften it up. So you get a little bit darker here and then we have the soft heather and then the cashmere haze in the um, kind of the middle third, I guess you could call it. So you could play with how intense you want this look to look <laughs> by um, even taking a little bit of the Merlot and you could line your eyes that way as well. So what I'm going to do is just take a tiny bit of the Merlot and I'm going to put it on the top part of my lid just a little bit, like just brushing it on top. I already have eyeliner on, so I'm just kind of putting it on top of the lid. We'll just give it a little bit more definition there. Okay. And then I'm actually going to go back to this, the cashmere haze and I'm going to line the under part of my eye. And again, I'm going to use another smudger brush. And I'm using that because I just find like the Merlot is really a beautiful color. If I had a little darker skin tone, then I might use the Merlot as a liner underneath. It's beautiful, but it can sometimes look too heavy for my coloring. So I'm just going to do a little bit of the cashmere haze underneath here. So I still get kind of a smoky vibe going, but I'm not going to weigh the eye down too much with that darker color. So I'm just kind of smudging it right there underneath the eyes. So, all right. <laughs> that is the uh, color set that I tried today that I thought would be really pretty to show you. So again, it was Blossom. I'll go ahead and put these up on the screen too so you can kind of go back and look at this. But Blossom uh, was all over the lid. Um, up to the brow bone. And then cashmere haze was kind of in this section right here. I kind of call it like the middle third of your eye. And then the um, soft heather was actually in the corner or the crease rather of the eye. And then we had the smudge of Merlot. Um, so I, the, the steps that I skipped were just basically blending, which was number four. Um, and then number five, lining the eyes. So that was the that would be the next step is just to make sure that you have that liner on. I just happen to already have it on. Um, but yeah, just smudging that Merlot. And I say over the upper and lower lid, I did try that, but I find again that was the reasoning why I switched it up. I'm gonna do the cashmere haze underneath the eye, and I just did a little bit of the Merlot on top. So um, I'm gonna grab a, another little bit of my mascara just to put on another coat. And then um, show you guys kind of the finished look here. So this is my absolute favorite mascara, Fanorama. The cheek color I put on, um, I believe. So Fanorama was the mascara. And then I have on um, Rosy Nude is a really pretty color to use for cheeks for this look. And then also another one is Rogue Rose. That's another one that's really pretty. And then last but not least, the lip color that I have on is a limited edition lip color and it is called Positive Impact. And I love this um, lip color. The reason is it's beautiful. Check this out. It's got all these little sparkles in it. It's beautiful. Um, but it's called Positive Impact. It's a it's a really pretty kind of dusty rose almost uh, color. So hopefully you're seeing it really true to color. It's just absolutely beautiful. So it's kind of on the 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 mauvey side um, without it being too deep of a color. 
and I love it. So the sparkles on here are really more so just decor for the, the lip color. So you're not going to get a whole lip full of sparkles. It'll look more like how I applied it where there's not a whole lot of sparkles. And you can see with the top of the lid, see how you can just see the coloring of the lipstick. So it's very pretty to look at, but you're not going to get sparkles all over the lips with this particular lip color. But as I showed you up on the screen, when you purchase this, oops, when you purchase this lip color, um, a dollar goes to the Mary Kay Foundation. So there is some uh, great benefit, not only for yourself, but also that donation. Uh, this is a limited edition lip color, and uh, it's something that the Mary Kay company is doing to help uh, promote the foundation. So every dollar um, goes to the Mary Kay Foundation, a portion of the, the purchase of the lipstick, a dollar will go to the foundation. And the foundation actually um, helps to uh, bring awareness um, and help fund uh, research that uh, is helpful in preventing uh, cancers that affect women and then also um, ending domestic violence. They, they donate a lot to uh, shelters and uh, they're very, very generous. Um, and it's just something that uh, has been near and dear to Mary Kay's heart and also just a fun way for you to uh, donate to the Mary Kay Foundation by just a purchase of the lipstick. So anyway, so that is um, the soft purple blossoms look. Let me know what you think about it. Uh, I do want to offer a freebie. So uh, comment blossom. And if you do, then uh, I will uh, contact you. I can send you out a um, uh, what should I call it here? A sample, right? Uh, of these beautiful colors. And you can request it from me. If you don't already have a Mary Kay Beauty Consultant, you can do that. If you have one, then go ahead and tag her name in the comments and then she can reach out to you and make sure that you get some of these samples as well. Okay. So thank you. Oh, wait, before I sign off, let me go ahead and show you those um, beautiful colors here on the screen. It'll just take me one moment to get this up. All right, here we go. So these are the beautiful uh, ways that um, different skin tones, skin color, um, yeah, skin tones and eye color, hair color, all have worn the uh, soft purple blossoms look. So isn't that beautiful? This was a little bit more like kind of the vibe I was going for with that particular look. Um, very soft over here and here. And uh, and even with uh, Jeanette, she looks beautiful with these colors on as well. So it's just amazing how fun you can get, how much fun you can have with these colors and what different looks you can get uh, just combining them uh, to be what you want them to be. So it's super fun. Here's a little bit more, again, dramatic look, which is beautiful too. These beautiful lashes there, and then a couple other color looks. So anyway, I wanted to show you that so you can kind of get a feel for, for what it looks like on different skin tones and all of that. So with that being said, I'm going to wrap it up now. Thank you so much for um, joining me today. I will catch you in the next video. And uh, remember, your makeup game will never be a 10 if your skincare game is only a two. So check your description down below. Also, I have a sample of a um, skincare miracle set, which you can also request as well. I'm a big believer in the fact that we have to take care of our skin, have a good skincare regimen, and then the makeup that we put on is going to uh, look fabulous, right? So you want to take great care of your skin and I have the most amazing products for you to try. So check out the description. You can order those um, free samples as well. All right. Bye for now. Thank you so much for watching. I would love for you to like, comment on this video, and subscribe to my channel. Every week I give you beauty tips, I give you movement tips, and I help you elevate your mindset. So if you'd like to give your confidence a boost, make sure to subscribe to this channel and you will get notified every time I post a video. I also have a free beauty gift for you, so check out the description below. There are also links to everything that I used in this video as well, so you can get your hands on those. I will see you next time.